I'm not talking about anyone specifically because this has actually happened to me on a few occasions, but um, this one I thought was like a good like story time video because it was someone that I was like kind of dating for a while, like that or that I was seeing for a while, dating, whatever you want to call it. So not anyone specific, I'm not naming names and it's not even a big deal. I just um, I just thought it was a good story time video for anyone who is well, let's just go into the story time video. It's nothing like a super crazy or anything, but I think if there's a good like little message at the end of it, um, to avoid heartbreak or breaking people's hearts in the future. So my ex is gay or bi. So I'm very <laughs> I'm very sometimes I'm very confused. Like I know bisexual is bisexual, but like, you know, if you you know, if you like the same sex and that's gay too, right? So I don't know. So I say he's gay, but obviously he was into me and we had sex and stuff like that, so I guess he's technically bi. But bi, the way I found out was, it's, it was just like a little crazy. So, okay, so I was dating sex for a period of time and sex was amazing. It was so good. Like everyone's like, oh my gosh, like anyone who would have like known this guy or whatever, like, you know, maybe, like for me, you know, I thought we thought like this guy that I, you know, was seeing for a minute was like gay. Um, and then I found out he wasn't because he obviously was having sex with me and sex with me a lot. And I was like, okay, he's not gay, cool, like, whatever. Um, you know, just, and I say cool because, you know, then I can have sex with them, you know, because there are so many hot gay guys that I wish I could have sex with. I was just like, uh, yes, please. Um, so I was, like, really excited because he was hot. I just thought he was gay. I was like, okay, there's no chance for me, really. Um, but then he's like, no, I'm not gay. And well, I was like, okay, cool. So, like, this whole time, any time I would make, like, I don't know, I think it's kind of like, uh, probably sounds so bad, what I want really to say. You know, I feel like anyone, and I have a ton of gay friends, of course, you know, they poke fun at, you know, oh my gosh, you're being gay, like, oh, you're, is that turning you on, like, home, you know, they call each other homeless. I know it's, like, offensive, and, like, you know, I would never, it's not, it's not meant to offend, you know what I mean? And some people are just more offended by being like, oh, you're gay, or that's queer, or, oh my god, like, you're such a homo, you know, like, those kind of things. And I feel like if you use them in context with friends and stuff like that, then it's like, you know, I guess it's all about context, anyways. So I would say that to him. I was just like, ooh, that's so gay of you. You know what I mean? Like, or, or that's so, like, you know, flamboyant of you. Or whatever it is. And he would get, like, super offended. Like, not super offended. I guess he would just be like, stop saying that, like, kind of thing. You know what I mean? So, point of all that was, he was very like, I'm straight. I'm straight. I only like women. And so you fall in love with this guy. Let's just fast forward and then I'll go back. So, fast forward to the end of us and I get an email um, from a trans person showing me text of this guy I was dating like penis and I was just like yep that's it and so I was like there was no ifs ands or buts about it so I just I just confronted him because it was like such a shock of all the things that have happened in the relationship with this guy and some of the other people that I found out later not quite the exact same thing I was so shocked. I was like, what? Like, this person's in a different city. This person, you know, like, met this person randomly online in kind of like this, like, seedy kind of way. And then, of course, you know, I saw the person's picture, and I was just like, oh, well, you know, it's a girl. It's like another chick or whatever he's banging, and then he's like, no, I'm trans or whatever. And I was like, okay, cool, because, like, you know, trans is whether, you know, this was particularly that happened to be a transvestite, not transgender. Like, he wasn't, like, you know what I mean? Like, so he was very, just very still, like, masculine and, like, kind of like that, you know what I mean? So I was like, okay, you know what, but still has aesthetic of, like, a female. So I was like, okay, you know, like, a, a natural-born female, if you will, because I know that they're female. But So I was like, okay, like, I get that, right, I get it. Um, but then I started, like, searching it more. So, again, it's, like, not even, I'm not even outing anything, because I started just, like, searching more into, like, his background and stuff like that. And it was just like, oh, like, he he likes guys, like there was him like sucking dick, like not pictures, but like people were like, yeah, he definitely got his dick sucked by this guy, and like definitely, th like this kind of thing, and I was just like, whoa, like it was like this whole other world. So this was all completely shocking to me, because it just like was not, I was just completely like taken aback, 